Hello, it's Dova King Liquid. So yeah, Morthal had some problems, but Sherlock Liquid and Dr. Lydia got to the bottom of it. Turns out, a couple of vampires were going to use the town as a buffet. So the Jarl gathered a rider die posse and wanted me to lead it. However, we got to the lair. This place looks dangerous. Yeah, kind of scary too. And it's full of vampires? Yeah. Cowards. We must kill the vampires. Hey! We have to make them pay. Of course. But why not let him go in first? Seriously? I thought we were boys, man. Don't fret over the gloom. There's nothing to fear. Old Lorbrook will brighten your spirits. Just lend him your ear. God damn it, Lorbrook. You, you're trying to throw me under the bus in here? The vampire cave and you want me to go in? Oh, Jesus Christ. Lydia. What are you doing, Stan Victor? Oh, fine. <laughs> well, at least Thornair was good to go. We sniped the master at a distance, and I got 400 gold, and everyone was happy. Now let's find out who left that known goose to grab. Peace. Dragonborn, I need to speak to you, urgently. Rent the attic room at the Sleeping Giant Inn in Riverwood and I'll meet you, a friend. Alright Lydia, let's see who this friend is. Stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. Really? Need a room? Talk to Delphine. Where's Delphine? Mm-hmm. What's on your mind? Are you Delphine? You're that visit. I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. I'd like to run a, the attic room. Attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room. But you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. Yes, my thing? Just waiting. I guess we're waiting. Go ahead, rest. So you're the Dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. I think you're looking for this. We need to talk. Follow me. What's on your mind? Close the door. Now we can talk. What's on your mind? All right, Delphine, what do you want? The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. That's the rumor. You're the one who took the horn? Surprised? I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. 
I was expecting someone taller. Good. The whole point of being in hiding is to appear to be someone you're not. What do you want with me? I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. You better start explaining fast. I'll explain what I want, when I want. Got it? You'd already be dead if I didn't like the look of you when you walked in here. But I had to know if the rumors about you were true. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. How do I know I can trust you? If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. Why are you looking for the Dragonborn? We remember what most don't, that the Dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Tastes like chicken. I absorb some kind of power from dragons, that's all I can say. This is no time to play the reluctant hero. You either are or aren't dragonborn. But I'll see for myself soon enough. You said the Thalmor are after you? Yes. We're very old enemies. And if my suspicions are correct, they might have something to do with the dragons returning. But that isn't important right now. What is important is that you might be Dragonborn. So what's the part where you're not telling me? Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. What makes you think dragons are coming back to life? I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty. And I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. Are we? If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. How did you figure all this out? You should know. You got the map for me. The Dragonstone you got for Faringar, remember? Right. You were at Dragon's Reach when I gave it to him. So you were paying attention. I arranged to have Farangar recover the Dragonstone for me. It's what I do. I make things happen from behind the scenes. After all, here you are. The Dragonstone was some kind of map? Yes. A map of ancient dragon burial sites. I've looked at which ones are now empty. The pattern is pretty clear. It seems to be spreading from the southeast, starting in the Geralds near Riften. The one near Kynesgrove is next, if the pattern holds. So where are we headed? Kynesgrove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. Let's go kill a dragon. I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. That's better. Let's get on the road to Kynesgrove. What do you think of this, Lydia? What's on your mind? Orgnar, I'm traveling. You've got the inn till I get back. Right. Happy trails. Kynesgrove is this way. We can travel together or split up and meet there. Your choice. All right, let's go together.
Waiting on you. You're leading this. I hope you're dragonborn, I really do. But we'll find out soon enough. Well, that's what I'm not. This is the biggest case of mistaken identity I've ever been a part of. dragon it flew over the town and landed on the old dragon burial mound I don't know what it's doing up there but I'm not waiting around to find out come on hurry get out, out of here get the cover Do something stupid. like 
coconut. Uh, it's true, isn't it? You really are dragonborn. That's what they say. I owe you some answers, don't I? Yep. Go ahead. Whatever you want to know. Nothing held back. Who are you and what do you want with me? I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were Dragon Slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest Dragon Slayer. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. What do you know about the dragons coming back? Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. I've seen that dragon before. The one that got away. Really? Where? It was the one that attacked Helgen with Ulfric when Ulfric escaped from the Imperials. Interesting. Same dragon. Damn it! We're blundering around in the dark here. We need to figure out who's behind it all. What's our next move? The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. What makes you think that Thalmor are bringing back dragons? Nothing solid, yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? Why are the Thalmor after you? Before the Great War, the Blades helped the Empire against the Thalmor. Our Grand Master saw them as the greatest threat to Tamriel. At the time, that was true. Maybe it still is. So we fought them in the shadows, all across Tamriel. We thought we were more than a match for them. We were wrong. So we need to find out what the Thalmor know about the dragons. Any ideas how? If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, it's the center of their operations in Skyrim. Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. So, how do we get into the Thalmor Embassy? Hmm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. As you say. Yes, my Thane? Alright, so we're going to go to that inn, spend the night, then we're going to go back to Iverstead. So we can give this horn back to the I've got your back. old guys, alright? Cool. Let's do this. Retrieve the horn of Jorgen Munk. Yeah. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. Ready to learn the final word of unrelenting force. Da, which means push. Da. With all three words together, this shout is much more powerful. Use it wisely. Master.
Master Wolfgar will now gift you with his knowledge of Dark. speak to you. Stand between us and prepare yourself. If you can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeards, but you are ready. of the Greybeards and passed through unscathed. High Hrothgar is open to you. All right, thank you. Had you. What was all that about? What were you shouting at? What were you shouting at me? We spoke the traditional words of greeting to a dragonborn who has accepted our guidance. The same words were used to greet the young Talos when he came to High Hrothgar before he became the Emperor Tiber Septim. What did you actually say? Ah, I sometimes forget you are not versed in the dragon tongue as we are. This is a rough translation. Long has the storm crown languished, with no worthy brow to sit upon. By our breath we bestow it now to you in the name of kind, in the name of shore and in the name of Atmora of old. You are Ismir now, the dragon of the north. Hearken to it. Ismir. I'd like to learn more about the voice. You have learned so much already, Dragonborn. Growing your gift too quickly would be dangerous. But there are many words of power in Skyrim, carved in the dragon tongue. Even from here we can feel the thum resonate from them. Finding these lost words would be a sufficient test to temper your abilities with experience. Ask when you are ready to search. Okay. Thank you. Sky, guard you. Sky guards you too. <laughs> 